Hey guys, I'm back with another video. Um, basically, I'm just trying to find ways to pass the time while I'm in this quarantine right now. I am working from home, but nowhere near enough work to keep me busy. Anyways, I had a request for this, I want to say maybe years ago, and I am just terrible with keeping up with videos, I admit it. Um, but I figured, why not do it now? Um, I'm going to compare two Chanel bags, the classic medium flap, and the boy bag in the old medium size. These are my only two Chanel bags that I currently own. They are by far my favorite style and my favorite bags that I own. Um, and they're very similar. So um, I thought I would do a comparison what can fit and just overall features. Right off the bat, you can see how close in size they are. In fact, I believe they might be exactly the same size except for the boy bag looks like no no I think they are exactly the same dimensions I'll have to look on the website to see what the exact dimensions are I know they're definitely both 10 inches long um obviously this one can be more dressy I feel like and this one can be more casual especially because I got it in chevron um but honestly you can dress up or down both of these I think so I'm just going to start quickly by taking everything I have out of here and putting it into the boy bag. Um, the capacities might be different. I actually don't know, so we'll find out. This is my medium uh, medium to large in the 18C iridescent caviar with shiny ruthenium hardware. Um, so we're gonna open up. I don't have anything in the back. I kind of, even though I'm not going anywhere, I kind of stuffed it as if I was going somewhere. This is what I would carry on a typical day. It is big enough for me to to um, carry everything that I need in a day because I don't, I don't use large bags. I don't put anything in this pocket and I don't put anything back here. And I don't have anything in here either. So this is typically what I would carry. Um, so I'm gonna take a, everything out and see how it fits in the boy bag. And I'll try to move quickly on this. Sunglasses, my Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet, tissues, um, keys, I have a nail file. I have a bunch of like um, eye drops and lip balms and stuff. I always have dental floss with me. And I've, I've done an, an, uh, what, can, what I carry in this bag video before, so there's no need for me to go through it again. Like I said, this is really just to compare um, the two bags. So I got everything out and I do have, I forgot that I have this little base shaper that I got off of eBay. And since both bags are pretty much the same dimensions, I use it in both of these bags, just because I don't want the bottom to bow out. I like the bottom to be nice and flat. So moving on to the boy bag. Um, this one is from 20 Cruise 2020 this season. Um, it's black caviar leather with ruthenium hardware and the Chevron. And oh, it smells so good still. I can I can still smell the, the really nice leather because I do keep it in a like a display cabinet. Okay, there's the bag. I'm gonna put my base shaper in. Right away you can see that it's kind of deceiving because the bottom, this bottom here doesn't go all the way down. So the capacity of the bag is and then same with the side here. So the bag looks this big. However, the actual volume and capacity is smaller. So I'm just gonna put everything in here really quickly, as quickly as I can, because I don't like to make long videos. And I know for a fact that everything fits just because this is what I typically carry. And I use this bag often because it's one of my all time, it might actually be my all time favorite bag. And let me just add everything else. And I do have a little bit of room in both bags where I could have added, you know, like a makeup, something, a makeup product. So here I am there and it fits perfectly. Uh, let me see if I have a compact. Yeah, right here. So sometimes I will carry a compact and let me see. You gotta play some uh, Tetris to get everything to fit, but it should easily fit. Yep, and it easily fits. So I'm pretty sure I could have fit the compact in the classic flap too. I just forgot to put it in there. 
Um, but as far as the chains go in like length, the boy bag chain is just a little bit, well, just a little bit longer. So I do have shorts on because I've haven't worn pants in weeks. Anyways, um, you can see how I, I feel like the classic five is just a little bit higher on me. And I do wear both of these both doubled and single chained. However, I do wear this one crossbody and I do not wear this one crossbody. So let's do single chain. And this is where we can really see that there is a difference in the chain length, a couple inches at least. So here the classic flap is, sorry, I had that thing in the way, um, single chained and on me. And then here, is the boy bag. Um, this crossbody, I am 5'3", by the way. I weigh about 120 to 125. I don't wear it like this. I don't think it looks right. So I typically wear this long chain like that. Um, this I do wear crossbody often. I think it's just barely long enough to sit on my hip properly and a lot of times I just wear it behind me like that so I do wear this one crossbody a lot I actually wear this one all three um single chained and and double chained I think I've been more into shorter straps lately so I've been kind of wearing it like this when I do carry it um anyways that's just a quick comparison um so some of the Similarities are the size and the capacity of the bag, I think are basically identical. Um, and you know, this one has compartments. This one just has one flat compartment. And I guess the biggest difference is just the chain length. And depending on your height, if you're a tall gal, you might not be able to wear this one crossbody. But um, you know, I'm 5'3", I can wear this crossbody and this one I can't really. So I just thought I'd do a quick comparison video if you would like any more comparison videos between any of the bags that I have, just let me know and I will see you next time.